You're about to know my rep. Hey, V. You ready? You nervous, Tom? How'd you know? First time you've done anything like this. Just imagine you're doing what a doll does. Just different program. You're great at that. So glad you came. Molded over in my head. Y'all were right. Sometimes the only rational course of action is a kick in the nuts and a bullet between the eyes. Any idea how I can get to Hiromi? Pulled the blueprint, got it all figured out. Okay, not all, but we're good on the penthouse. Best bets to access it from the service level. Got a way in from there. Just remember, let the behavioral chip do what it wants. Got no time to deliberate and weigh decisions. Just follow your instincts. Freeze, tense up even for a second. Could cost you your life. And Michael, where's she? Meeting with Hiromi to avoid raising any suspicions. She'll make him stay put until we're in. All right, we going in? Let's do this. right after us. Go straight to clouds. About fucking time. I'm Jillian Jordan, and this is the latest Stay sharp. the world. Gangoons might be lurking. A green sky uranium mine collapse that occurred just outside Nova Sibirsk in southern Siberia has concluded with a happy ending. Got a jacket at the panel on the other side. Can you take him out? What then? Everyone all in position? Tom and Roxy should already be at Clouds. We go on Maiko's signal. They'll mop up security, you deal with Hiromi. But first, you gotta get into the penthouse. Not coming with me? More likely not to be detected if you're alone. Besides, I'll be more useful here. If they activate any alarms, I can override. Get in breach, security. Get me in the penthouse? Thought I could do it, but... Sorry, it's not gonna happen. Gotta manage on your own. Okay. On my way. Elevator's on the other side. Be safe.
the Sitch. They're inside the clouds. Who's taking which floor? I'll take the lower level. Tom will head upstairs. We're all set. to the balcony. Careful though, okay? I'll be late. <laughs> On my mark. I told you. Go! Tastes like sawdust anyway. Less trouble getting here. Same here. Go to the surveillance cam in front of the security room. Into virtues. It'd be game over otherwise. Right, wrong. Chicks will give you shit no matter what you do. This one's a real charmer, too. I don't like her either. Tries too hard. Could have called off the guards, you know? Would have been quicker, simpler. I don't have that kind of authority yet. Why are there three guys? What's she planning? That's our at? target, Hiromi Sato. What are they watching? Demo reel of Cloud's next top doll, specially selected by yours truly. The lucky girl's gonna replace Evelyn. Hope she proves smarter. Who are the other two? Target audience of today's presentation. Hiromi answers to them directly. Now they're gonna watch him die in a pool of his own piss. This is not what we agreed. Look at me. See this? This is a look of unfucking surprise on I my face. I know the claws. To them, power is a question of strength, ruthlessness. This is the only way. Michael! I'm about to jack him out. They will not be chirpy after the rude awakening. One show ends, another begins. Just as good and unforgettable. Understand? Michael, our plan made no allowance for witnesses. 
A show of force, we said. And any show requires an audience. I promised to help Judy, and here we are, thanks to her. But little Jude's cut from a different cloth than you and me. She's dreaming if she thinks she can have justice and peace in Night City without cuts, bruises, and blood. Meaning you want to replace her only. Mm-hmm. Even if that means joining the Tiger Claws. How the fuck else do you expect me to protect Clouds from other gangs? Don't like this one bit. Too late for second thoughts. Tom and Roxy have done their part. Your little doll revolution is underway. Either we consolidate and win it all, or let everything go to waste. Do your thing. Well, she is no Barker. Wait. What's going on? Who is this? Living proof that Hiromi Sato's time is up. This merc has already disturbed the clientele at Clouds once. She murdered Oswald Forrest. And now she's invaded Mr. Sato's private residence. As if that were not enough, this is where Hiromi's sheer incompetence has led all of us to. What? What the hell? I have long looked upon Hiromi Sato's foolish, inept endeavors. But this? I think it's obvious he has outlived his usefulness. V, what the fuck's she doing? Clouds need new management. Am I to understand that this future manager stands before- Hold on, Maiko. Think you're getting carried away. I see not all has been agreed. V, you gotta take him down. That's why we're here. Bored of all this chatter. I'd rather we just cut to the quick. Oh, fuck! Matter of fact, I do. Either you walk away and never come back to Clouds, or I end you here and now. I see you got everything planned out, but you forgot just one thing. I've also got a doll chip. All right, V, get out of there. Exit's on the lower level of the apartment. Then find the elevator. Tom and Roxy are outside and safe. They weren't followed. Get down to street level, waiting by the food stalls. Probably had this planned from the start. Same sec we walked into her office. Jesus, am I a gunk. Don't be dramatic, Judy. There's a difference between being a gonk and believing people want to do good. I know you do. You don't need to believe that. I just know it.
You're watching WNS News. New details have emerged on the attempted abduction of Hanako Arasaka at the Arasaka-sponsored Dashi Parade. Early accounts first reported that the assailants struck as the parade was in full swing. They overwhelmed and seized control of the Arasaka Heiress's parade platform. Fortunately, Arasaka's security forces, under the personal direction of Yorinobu Arasaka, quickly tracked down the abductors and secured Hanako-sama. Yorinobu-sama has since issued a public statement condemning the perpetrator's deplorable actions and promising swift retribution. To those who raise a hand against the Arasaka family, I promise you, we will rip the hand off and pour salt in the bloody stump. Bored of all this chatter. I'd rather we just cut to the quick. Matter of fact, I do. Either you walk away and never come back to Clouds, or I end you here and now. I see you got everything planned out, but you forgot just one thing. I've also got a doll chip. Given what I saw. I knew she'd be a bigger jackbooted tyrant than Hiromi. And that was reason enough to take her life? Sorry, Judy. I, I didn't plan for it to happen. I know. Give me a sec. I gotta gather my wits. I, uh... I gotta process all this in peace. Alone. Be seeing you, V. See ya, Judy.
Wondering, wouldn't happen to have any gigs for me. Nope. Nothing. Really? Not for you. Thanks. Appreciate your honesty. Only thing you'll get here for free. See the regulars? They've got dozens of jobs behind them. They trust each other. Now put yourself in my shoes. How do you think it'll look when they find out I'm putting a crew together with you in it? You had one job with Dex, and fucked it up, spectacularly. You know that's not true. Who cares? This isn't about skill, V. Only thing that matters is reputation. Why do you think you work alone? Look, V, just do what you do best, all right? Up with Hellman. Worked out in the end? I know. Cutting half a Night City's power to down an AV? That's how shit around here used to get done. How are things done now? Conservatively. Everything's cold, calculated, less improvisation. That sounds like you missed the good old days. Huh. If you went back in time and told me I'd be a fixer, I'd have laughed in your face. Pan Am deserves most of the credit. Wouldn't happen without her. I know. That's why I recommended her to you. Is that all? Ask you a personal question? Sure, but ask at your own risk. Used to know Johnny Silverhand. What was he like? Uh, Johnny? Where did that come from? Seemed to be as many rumors about him as there were 50 years ago. And not all of them gel together. No, you two were close. I asked. Huh. What was Johnny like? Strong. <laughs> Arrogant. Uncompromising. He'd burn down half the city just to prove he was right. And burn the other half just for fun. He was like a kid with a box of matches and a can of chew, too. Tough luck. You don't know the half of it. Later. Да не подключайся.
This number is temporarily unavailable. Please leave a message. I, uh... Talked to Misty. We were at your place. That mandala you made? It was total shit. But, uh... Misty appreciated it. Maybe me a little too. So... Nice work. With some trouble in Japantown at the parade. What'd you hear? Corpos opened fire. Civilians were killed. Yeah, that was kind of my fault. <laughs> Don't ask me how, but the second I heard, I knew you were involved. Just wanted to talk to Hanako. Things went a little sideways from there. Dealing with corpse? What did you expect? What else is going on besides that? Ah, uh, you know, same old. Rather hear where you've been up to. It was nice catching up. I'm right here, V. Call me anytime.